Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 2022 Derby City Classic. This is round seven bank pool. We got Butch Brumback versus Jason Shaw. This is exciting. Diamond Billiard Products, Bad Boys TV, OB Custom Cues. This is Butch shooting right here. Um, not the only Brumback famous for bank pool and apparently not a relation from the same town. Totally unrelated. It's hard for me to believe. I still think they're messing with me, but we will see. This is Jason Chow with his real opening shot, played safe there. Drills that bank. Mr. 714 himself takes a 1-0 lead. Two. Six ball, same pocket. Three. Wow. Jason Shaw is somebody that you see hit the ball with quite a bit of confidence. Four. Hold up, cue ball. Oh, I think he's going to have to settle for four. He might try that to clip that three ball. I don't think so. There we go. We see those balls all come back together. That was pretty close. All right, four and almost out for Jason Shaw. That brings Butch Brum back to the table. We've got a camera crew following Alex back lying around. That's pretty hilarious. Hey, that's that guy you played. Alex Bagelin. Highlighting Rick Bonnie Jones there on the... Right? Isn't that nice? On his television program. What is, what's going on with I, Alex? Uh, well, now, see, you're making... You assume Jason I know what's Sha happening. Meanwhile, Jason Shaw gets out in game one. I know nothing. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. He's certainly an interesting guy, though. Good for him. Yes, he is. It's so funny. I'm trying to find out when he plays. You know, the nice thing about a camera crew in this room is it's not distracting. There's <laughs> <laughs> nothing distracting about somebody doing your lighting in the middle of a fucking pool tournament. Sorry. <laughs> I think we're allowed to say that. In Rick the middle of care. a fucking we, pool we tournament. We choose not to cuss. He's got a Rick fucking lighting guy. Rick Are you kidding me? <laughs> that is hilarious. Well, if he wasn't before, he is now world famous Rick Jones. Now he's on some fucking <laughs> television program. <laughs> That's yeah, Alex Bagelion. Uh, but good for him. Couldn't happen to a nicer guy. Uh, Jason ran four and almost out. Uh, got his fifth ball there. Butch the back. Yeah. From the same town. Yeah. Not related to that guy right there. I, so I, I'm going back on my story from the previous match. You guys don't know what I'm talking about. I'm sorry. That's just all I do. Um, uh, Joe Brown I played. I yeah. just tell Joe Brown, uh, he says, you still in it? I say, uh, no, I lost to Alex Pagalon. He says, no, nah, he plays all right. That's how good Joe Brown plays banks. He's like, yeah, you could have taken him. To I be go, thanks, bro. To be fair, that's what you said, too. That's, so yeah, like, that's, know, he yeah, plays right. pretty good. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, that was 60 minutes? Wow, that's cool, That's so man. cool. Wow, that's really awesome. You know what I said? <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny. Oh, that's funny. That's great. I like it. I, I should have given a... 60 minutes Hi, Mom. Doing All right. Uh, meanwhile, the match in action. Uh, hey, I, just want, like I, I want you to know, your mama knows you say hi. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Tell my mama she I said knows hi. You it, man. She knows. She knows. She knows you say hi. All right. Slate uh, bank it two on the side. She knows. Yep, two on the side. Swish. Nice. I should have highlight reeled. I wonder Jason if I'm going to be on line. 60 Minutes getting beat by Alex. Wouldn't that Man, be a thrill? Were they filming your match? Um, they were around, actually. Interesting. Maybe you will be. The tricky thing about that is they, they kind of have to be filming it to, to be on there. But you'll be part of that story. They, uh, they were around filming stuff. They were. Yeah, they, they were. They were. But let's That's be honest. That's cool. They, they ain't putting me on the show. I mean, maybe they want his they triumphant like, victories, you know? They were like, is there a 15-year-old gray-haired hippie-looking fellow that we could put on there? 
I got just the guy. Right? We got just the guy. You know, Mike D? You mean 60 Minutes Mike D? Right. All right, so this is Butch Broomback. No relation to John Broomback, and don't say there is. You prefer the Broomback. Instead of Brombach? Uh-huh. Yes, I spell it like it's, I, I say it like it's B-R-O-O-M. Is that what you're saying? Broom, Instead of yeah. boom? Uh-huh. That's true. Ooh, like a U. Brom. Wow, a little wide. Very close, though. I saw Butch playing earlier, and I was like, that he can make the ball. I actually really? played next to him. Really? Yeah, bank strong. Again, this is round seven action. Butch Brumback versus Brumback versus Jason Shaw. Um, surprised to see Jason miss that. He has just not missed many balls. He fired these straight backs in three in a row from, from distance, just drilled it. I have a test question for you. How many times have I asked you, uh, what was Jason's high run playing straight pool? Three. Okay, this is four. What was Jason's high run playing straight pool? It's a lot. It was a lot. It was over 700, right? It was. Nice. You know how many John Schmidt ran? No. 626. 626. 626. Mr. 626. Mazda himself. You know how many Jason Shaw ran? No. 714. That's a 711 okay. plus three. Okay. Wow. Also, yeah. And Jason's not even a straight pool player. And that's what's incredible about it. And I, I love it. He is just one of the most exceptional pool players of all time. Uh huh. Yeah, he didn't even miss. He. he all right, he just slid off of the rack up table. Totally. He I was hits that ball to hard. Chai, I was going to tell him congratulations on shooting your seven twenty six, but it, it was seven fourteen, so I decided not to. I just stuck with He's even congratulations. Got a hat. The Joneses are looking around at me like I'm sitting on something, and there's a good chance I am. What are you missing? A flannel jacket. I okay. not want I've got I've got a dollar that says that's a Costco jacket. Think so? I think so. I'll take that bet. Oh, that there almost go. man. He just tried a nice shot on the side. James DeV over there. Do you know if James is still in? Uh, no, he's out of banks. Uh, oh, actually, I saw him get put out. Yeah, yeah. I did better than James DeV. That's awesome. You and James have kind of had a competitive rivalry. You guys, you guys played in the, was it the finals of Worlds? Yeah, which is ridiculous to me because he is better than I am by a fair amount. But, yes, we seem to. Uh, James has been playing a lot of We pool, seem man. to uh, uh, end up about the same spot in tournaments uh -huh. about a fair amount of the time. But uh, he's definitely better than I am. Playing out of Texas these days, formerly out of the Northwest. He's, he says no. He's back to Washington. He is. Well, that's good for Washington. That's bad for Team Oregon. Uh, yes, Even and I think technically he was, he was always shot. a resident of Washington, uh, so he could have played. He was Man. traveling. Nice shot. Yeah, Beautiful that was sweet. shot there. That was sweet. Uh, four ball, same shot. Is it Filmer, Filler and Gomez in the finals? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, it looks like it. All right, is this the finals right now? It's either the finals or the second. It might be the second semis. Okay. Yeah. Well, luckily in 2062, nobody cares. It's true. Speaking of which, this is the 2022 Derby City Classic. Summerfield and Mike D coming to you with Bad Boys TV. Yeah, Butch you making Diamond, another one. Uh, Diamond Billiard Products. This is their tournament. He so Butch brought back that Butch right got in. another ball? Yeah. So, uh, Okay. Um, this counts off. Three, I think it might be 3-0 oh because Jason, mm, yeah, if you don't mind checking, sorry, thank you. Gosh darn it, I did that last time. Skyler and Shane, and I screwed the score up. I do apologize, we do try to keep good track of it, but it is harder than you think. I'm going to guess it's 3 nothing. But Jason, not going to let it be nothing for long. Never mind, two to one. Thank you to Mike D for doing the research. Jason missing that ball. 
Oh yeah, it's it's so close. I mean, that is not worth. I mean, it's just it's just worth running over there and checking out. Yeah, uh, we've been at some events where it's a little farther to go see. It's true. Uh, yeah, this this one. The longer I do this, the more I recognize that this one is not bad. Just get up and go see. For sure. There's ones where you got to go hit a hallway, which is nice in its own way. Sometimes yeah. it's nice to be off in a. Yeah, when you're sitting there in talking in the guy's back swing. Yeah, exactly. That's tough enough. Yeah, some places we're too close. All right, one rail on the three. I think so. Just top top left. Oh, I see. I was Very thinking nice. top left. Honestly, that was that was a great shot. He's gonna take that same shot on the seven ball here. Unfortunately, this one's a steep angle. Also, might have to jack up a little bit. Not looking like it. Just gonna push straight yeah. through. And the, with the two, he's got to come in high instead of low. Boy, that was a nice Man. shot at the right, right side of the to four. Too. And he's got a straight cross Butch side. Boom back is a good banker. He yes, he good. is. No relation to John. Well, John's Brumback. This is Broomback, so a little different. Same thing. Taking down game number two. Listen, that was strong. We got a match here. That was strong. Heck, yeah. Nice out there. Nice shot, Butch. And Jason came out hot, but nothing doing in that second game. Had a couple opportunities. And Butch to break. I think this is Butch's first break. Let's see what he can do. Mason playing John Brumback over there. Watch John hit this ball. I love watching John play. I'm starting to really respect his focus uh, and his affect at the table. Do you see him uh, just be very disappointed that Mason wasn't watching him make this ball? Uh, yes. Is he going to call it again for him? He's got a little waggle, a little mustache comb. Yeah, I like his game a lot. That guy plays good. <laughs> I think so. Apparently I should, right? Michael Brumbe Broomback. I had no Mike idea. Mike D. Brumback. Good. Is that how it works? I feel like Summerfield Brumback has a good good ring to it. Summerfield's such a great name, yeah. though, dude. You don't want to mess with that. You got to earn your Brumback. It's like wearing 23, you know? You can't just, you can't just do you it. You got to earn it. All right. Now, again, for me, main goal, oh my don't gosh. scratch. John Brumback just miscued and scratched. Heartbreaker there. Oh, see, that's uh, I don't like that cue ball. No, no fence push. Uh, but that is my big fear. Yeah, flying around. Yeah. Uh, but two I'd down on the slow break, break, and he's shooting. Soft break? What's the, is there a soft break there, rule on this? There is a rule. Um, Three points, something like that. I don't know what it is. It's not the nine ball. You just it's make not, one up. It, yeah. Uh, three balls have three to Three balls have out. to, yeah. No. Every time. They call it, it's a Mike Playing D the pass on this nine. Switch. Nice. Really hoping that two ball stays up because that's what he's going to shoot next. Yeah, right. Boy, he'd love to st string two or three together yeah. at the beginning. That seems to be the key to this game. If you can be the guy to get those first two, three balls, because that seems to be when the easy pickings are out. So yeah. if you can be that guy and get them, then you're that guy. Yeah, I guess then you're that guy. Then you're that guy. You're the guy that's up three. Guess he could try the eight ball here, but I definitely like playing the two. Oh, me too. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Um, I think the, the side pockets are the most open. I think so, too. I think they're the, the smartest to go for. The widest pockets. Wowzers. Yeah. There we go. Up to two nothing for Butch. Yeah. You know, if you're playing Jason Shaw, just holding your own is tough. You know. Right. So this guy is assertively beating Jason Shaw. He is... Uh, stiffing this. So this is the kind of one pocket peg. Oh no, he crossed it. All right, so two are going to spot. And hmm, takes away a pocket from Jason. Jason doesn't really have a whole lot doing here. Can he back the eight to the top left? I don't think so. I think it's going to be in the way. Yeah. I think no. the one, well, I, think I don't he, know. I think he can two rail the eight ball. But, uh, if you draw that line right there, that's pretty tight. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't think it goes. But I think if anybody can do it, it's Oh, he is. He's calling it. Uh, but I don't think it goes. Swish. He hits the... Oh, my God. I was it's completely so wrong. Good. Oh, I didn't see that ball. That's the hidden ball. Trying to roll up behind that point. Nice. Almost got there. Nice opening shot there for Jason Shaw. Spotting that ball up.
And we know that Butch can bank the ball, but if he can keep up with Jason in this type or this portion of the game, yes, he had a good chance. So it looks like he's going to thin off that. Hopefully, that eight ball might catch the six, might play the two, uh, and that's that's a bank pool shot right there. Yeah, but I was head ball. I was able to do that a few times. Yeah, it's rem- reminiscent of the straight pool shot, you know. Yep. They'll come back together. The other one I was able to do was uh, slide the cue ball off the stack and back into the stack gently, like in one pocket. Yeah. And that's a powerful move, too. For sure. Hmm. All right. Nothing this is doing a good, here. No, this is, that's a great lead right there. Yeah. I think thinning off the two. Oh, oh he's calling it. So one rail on the two ball to the bottom right hand corner. And don't scratch. Wow, very close. Uh, Boy, I, that, know, man. Yeah, I, mean, I don't know, I, if it, it was, was worth it. It was very close, but yeah, that's what I'm saying. Is yeah. it wasn't. He should have. He should have done it differently and stayed up table. No offense, but I'm out of the tournament. You'd whoop me. So Jason passing the six ball, coming back, trying to break these balls out. Nice try. Nice shot. Excuse me. That's straight nice back eight was. ball. Dude, I think you got to go two rails on the two ball. I would, and I'm not saying I would you're wrong, okay? Because I, I know I the pros yeah. do it. I just I look at that shot and I think I'm taking two rails on the two ball. Yeah, I'm gonna double oh. kiss that all day. There, once there I double, you go. Once He's I double it. kiss, I'm scratching. Glad I just I assume know. every double kiss is gonna result in the in cue ball getting s- slapped into the pocket, and that's just awful. So that was the four railer he hit there, and two two. He was trying to go two, but. Be the four. He left, uh, I think he left Sky the bank on the two ball, cross corner, although. And what's crazy is Sky's not even playing. Oh, God, good point. Good point, yeah. Jason. But if he had left that for Sky. I was doing that with Billy for uh, Sky. Sky, it dealt with. Jeez. It's kind been a, of a couple days Ooh. without more to go. Yes, indeed. Well, I'm not leaving Jason much. Um. Okay. Can play off the one. He could also play off the eight ball here, and I kind of like playing off the eight. Nope, going to play off the one. He's trying to make sure he doesn't combo the one and the three in. I would have met. Never mind. All right, so he left the key ball in a spot where he felt. It did seem like he didn't want to do that. I got to say, he left him a shot. Oh, yeah. I'm if not I sure I would have wanted to pocket the ball. If I know Butch's last name, I know he's going to shoot this ball. Straight back. So is it a straight back in, in both corners? Or is I this know. I don't think this is no, cross I think corner. It's, no, I think it's no. That's why I just tapped the pocket. Wow, well, held it too up much. too much. <laughs> and in unison, one, two, three, four. One of us, could, up. One of us could go take a nap. <laughs> We're gonna do that. Anybody listening is probably incorrect. Like right. you should. When hey, you guys should take a nap. Yeah. Yeah. When do you have a salad? When do you take right, a nap? Exactly. Some of you have key lime pie. He, that I is like what that. he asked. If my he, yes, he, like, he asked if it was key lime pie. I, I don't know what to tell you. He meant it too. That was not a joke. No, the man did not recognize the salad when Rick he is at not it. well. He did not know yeah. he's not well. World famous. What Rick does he jokes. like to drink at the concession stand? Is it pink lemonade? What does he like? No, the uh, he doesn't drink soda anymore. I almost bought him Big Red, and I forgot he said he's off soda. That's right. So what did he want? He wanted something. Mm. Sweet tea. Sweet tea, that's right. I think we're obligated to get him a sweet tea when we go there. He said something about you went there and that didn't bring me. I think that's what he was talking Not about. Not cool. I've Again, offered him drinks several uh, times. People listening don't care about. Yeah. Bring All right. Rick Jones sweet tea. Right. So one ball, one time. Wide. Yeah. That looked like one of my banks. That's what I'm saying. When I do that, I want to kick you somebody. It, yep. I'm like, did I just do that? Was I aiming for the side pocket? Almost made it in the side. That was so far off. I'm Some, embarrassed. Like, did you see Jason there? I'm going to catch that replay. He kind of like stayed at the table and kind of walked towards it. I feel like Jason is ready to punch someone. Was he intimidating the table? Do you A feel lot like? of the time. Wow. And Ooh, I, the three was funny there. And to be fair, I have never seen him punch anything or be aggressive. No. Competitive, yeah. No. But, well, maybe the table rubbed him the wrong way, buddy. I'm still pretty sure. Let's not judge. A big line of boxers, Jason Shaw. I yes, I well, I heard he. I think uh, 
I think let's not screw up our rumors. I hear Darren Appleton is from a family of boxers. Family I boxers. heard Jason used to box a little bit, and he's lately been getting back into it. Oh, man. And that's why he uh, is gained some weight. It's muscle. Well, I believe Martin Shaw, Jason's father, was a boxer also. Really? And that's where he got his, now his see, boxing okay, Now, see, okay. People listening, I want you to know something. Summerfield has real information, all right? I have things I heard one time on a Facebooky thing that I don't remember anymore. I am the uncle you can't trust. And I don't mean like that. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just saying, like, information-wise. Well, I was going to say an I even more so because I completely made all that up. Um, but I, I don't want to jump in on the uncle you can't oh. trust thing. That was, oh. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Jason, I don't know your father. Uh, but, but I imagine he could hold his own in a boxing ring. Side pocket here. Swish. Wowzers. He's on the hill. Dude. Man, he's a, yeah, one spot shot straight back away from going up 2-1 on Jason Shaw. Do you think Butch got called Butchie the Kid ever? Every, every time I hear Butch, Butch I think no, Butchie the no, Kid. Cause I, no, I think Butch is an adult uh, nickname for him. Okay. I don't think it's Got his it. real name, and I think that he started being called that when he was an adult. Do they do nicknames here? In Kentucky? I think Bud and Butch are nicknames. You're from Montana, aren't you? Did he just drill that three-railer? Wow. Like, Bud is, is a pretty general nickname, an actual nickname. It's not just something you call people. Some people's actual huh. second name is Bud. Uh-huh. Right? It, it definitely is. But I'm do you think, think they would write that on the on the sheet? That would be like your pool tournament name is Bud? No. I don't either. No. Jason Shaw coming within a ball, 4-3. Oh, we're not done talking about this. You think his mom named him Butch? Yeah. Is that what your argument is? Uh, I'm, I'm not arguing anything, but if I had to guess, I would guess that man's name is Butch. What do you think Butch is short I, for? I know multiple Butches. What is Butch short for? Butcher? Uh, I I don't think it's short for anything. I think his name might be Butch. That's what I was afraid you were going to say. Two rails Two on rail? the rail. <laughs> <laughs> I think you said earlier, see, that's why you're arguing with old men. Um, Butch, and if I, you're listening to this later and you notice that I'm being a little more careful with my words than Summer, that's because Summer is six foot nine and I'm about five foot eight. <laughs> and you, I, you look pretty large, Butch. I would be totally bummed if Butch felt disrespected by my commentary. Uh, and, well, I know you think you would. And again, I have a weird like mentality with this. I feel like I have the Summerfield free pass. If your name's Summerfield, <laughs> I feel pretty entitled to talk about names with just about anybody. I get that. So I definitely mean no offense. And Butch, your bank pool game is far more interesting Dude. than your name. I tell you what. Yeah. Just yes. about drilled that. Did you yeah. see how thin he hit that ball yeah. and almost drug yeah. it all the way yeah. down to that pocket? Yes. Uh, I would say in this match, Butch is the aggressor and the better of the two players. Um, at least if you didn't know who was playing, they were both wearing white T-shirts right now, just guys playing. Yeah. You'd say, well, Butch is definitely kicking that one guy's butt. You should have seen Jason Shaw in game one. I thought he was going to run five and out, and he wasn't. He was not in position to run five and out. But yeah, the three straight backs he hit in a row were just, right. it was like the pocket was just wide right. open. Right. He wasn't even thinking about it. Yeah. But yeah, it's definitely tightening up a little bit for him now. I'm curious to see how Butch plays this because he's definitely a, a bank pool player. I really like back banking this at the oh, upper left hand corner pocket. I I won one of my matches, uh, uh, hill 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 hill, uh, with the cue ball in the in the pocket and back banking it. Uh, yeah, it doesn't scratch, so you should go for it. And so it's he, safe if you do it at the right speed. Your turn. He's playing at four rails, and oh. that, that's the other. That's how I think a bank pool player would play this shot. I see, and I felt like uh, because I was so far in the pocket, four rails just wasn't an option. I couldn't get a hold of the cue ball enough. That was obviously a good oh. shot. My God, he almost made it. And yeah, it's safe. And, and hangs it in the pocket. That's a very good shot. Two rails in the corner is what I'd do if I was yeah. playing one pocket on this. I've made this before, playing one pocket. Yep, the key's just not making second contact. Ooh. Yeah, and I think you got to hit it long, let it drift a little, and tighten up. Man, I smoked in a long two-railer. I had I had tricky little ball situation here mm -hmm. and oh, that's in that ball is I like that. That is Boy, in the that pocket. Was strong. Man, Butch, Butch nice back, shot. Taking a two one lead here at the twenty twenty two Derby City Classic. This is round seven action. Uh short rack bank pool. Well done. He's ahead of Jason Shaw leading two one. 
So I got a cluster here. Yeah. Cue ball here, object ball here. So I got to draw. I guess it was a little thinner. But I had to draw down under these balls. And I mean, hit. I fired that ball and just back of the pocket. It was right, awesome. Oh, wow. That's and awesome. And I always miss that. I used to always miss it wide. So now I overcompensate. Okay. And I've okay. been missing it short. And it was pretty awesome. You just drilled it, huh? I'm nice. stoked. Nice. Pool is cool. Pool is cool. Right? Uh, it's not a great story, telling people how this one time I made this two-railer. I'm, I'm sure so that is not I, impressive. I, I, what, you know, that's just a table with the balls racked on it. What else is there to do? I can't wait to start playing at one pocket, man. I'm jealous that you got to start already. Me yeah, too. I'm itching for one pocket. I like how this tournament's set up. At first, you got to bank everything. And yep. then after that, you don't have to bank anymore, but yeah, you can only We're use one lose. pocket. And then after that, they're like, all right. These nine balls, hit balls that one ball yeah. and put it in any pocket you want. It just it's changes so around true. every time. You're like, oh, this is okay. Pick a rule. Take something away. I like it. Right. All right, two down on the break here. I do not see him stiff in that seven ball. I think the nine ball would work around the four if he chooses to do that. I think the eight ball goes in that corner pocket. Um. Again, not an easy opening shot. No, I agree. Is this Danny Olson? Is that his name? I think you're right. Yes, I think you're right. Young kid. Strong player. Yeah, plays good. Mm. What's your shot here? Um... I think uh, the six in the bottom left corner. Hmm. He's playing this three rails. He played a wide three railer earlier. Wow. Jason freaking Shaw. I want you to know that I wouldn't have tried that. All right, so get him a game, a, a point. I'll do it. Yay. Just don't hate me. Stiff in that eight ball. Not that, that wasn't Jason. But aren't those his tattoos? I'm sorry. No, it was totally, I knew I did it wrong because I knew that he broke. I apologize, everybody. One. Zero. One. Ball spotted. Eight balls on the table, one. <laughs> you know, it doesn't help us when I tell you the opposite happened of what really happened. Woo. Oh, I don't blame you at all. I totally thought that was Jason. Okay, so Jason definitely made that one. Yes, he did. Leaves himself uh, picnicked over this five ball, though, unfortunately. Yes, yes, he's hampered. Hampered. Picnicked. Yeah. Yep. We learned that wow. term from Mark White, although I think you have to say his name, Muck. Mock White. Mock Indeed. White. Yes. Fellow commentator. I Mark sounds great too, doesn't he? He's so awesome. Yeah, he's a really fun dude. We got to work with down in Vegas and hope to work with him in the future as well. Oh, definitely. Oh, nice shot. Jason, Jason heating up. Shaw. Four ball straight back in the pocket. <laughs> John and me are spending all our money here on merchandise and clothing. I've bought so many shirts. I told Julie, Julie, I'm in the money, and I spent all my money on your clothes. I think you guys are winning. I've got every color diamond shirt they yeah. make. Now I can afford to buy all of them. Right. Are Collect there any new the shirts line. up there? It's the same ones. Same ones. And I got I got a black, blue, and, uh, and a blue sweatshirt. Nice. And I got uh, my dad and my son uh, shirts, too. Ooh. Oh, that's it's cool. my son's birthday here, February 5th, and my dad's my dad. And my dad's my dad. So he gets a shirt. All right, moving his game coin there. Jason Shaw with a 3-1 lead. My daughters will get airport toys. Isn't that the typical dad go away on business trip thing? The thing is, we don't leave this hotel the whole time we're here. Uh, no, no, it's I, not I like think I'm you're better off in the airport than the yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. So I am now the dad that buys his kid stuff with the... Airport. I should Our definitely get my girlfriend a Derby City Classic shirt. She'd be thrilled. You know you have to get her something. I, if I you don't, don't get her anything, you know she'll say that's okay. And then she'll always remember that you didn't get her anything. Huh. So she always remembers that I've never gotten her anything? 
Oh Her my God! Just a second. Are you saying that you haven't gotten her anything previously? No, we don't. I, we don't do gifts when I travel. Who's we, Kimasabi? You. We're talking about you getting her stuff. Here's the difference, mm-hmm. man. Highlight reel. Jason Shaw. That's how you get out. Two two. Nice. Never count any of these guys out, man. That was a nice out. Um, I don't know if you know this, but uh, my girlfriend is kind of a rock star. And so she travels an awful lot. And you know what doesn't happen when she comes back from tour? She doesn't bring me stuffed animals. God damn it, that's not actually true. Uh, she doesn't bring me stuffed animals, but she did bring me a cigar Summer, and a little you're flask. wrong. You're just wrong. I just, oh nothing my God. you say matters or makes any sense. You're wrong. I have it in my summer. mind that I'm like this good partner, this good boyfriend, and apparently I'm sure you're I'm a good wrong. boyfriend, but Summer, it's $7. You got to get her something. I mean, come on, bro. You got to get her something. It's a rule. I don't feel like a $7 gift is going to appease my... See, when you start talking, it sounds like you're speaking in French. I don't feel... See, I don't care what you feel. I don't... No, you don't get a vote. You don't get an opinion. Huh. You got to take There's for something, rules. bro. Yeah. Okay. That's like, would you show up to a kid's birthday party without taking a present for the kid? Yeah, maybe. Uh, almost never. If I'm going for the parent... I'm looking at it somewhere with disgust and shocked right now. I want people listening. It was... Don't, if you go to a child's birthday party, for God's sakes, pick up a gift. Go to Dollar Tree and get a Barbie. It was kind of like one of the in. early scenes of Ghostbusters when like people don't really know there's ghosts yet. That's how you're looking at me. Yeah. You're like, yeah. is this a ghost? It, it, what does make sense, though, is that the same guy that doesn't bring his girl a present goes to kids' birthday present parties without a present. And once means seven times. To be fair, I've almost never done that. Uh, but it's happened. <laughs> I collect old money, like the old denominations of money, and I, I oftentimes just give kids money because that's what I wish people would have gotten me to give me a Barbie in a in a toy bag, you know? Summer, do you eat dinner over the sink? No. Okay. No. Okay. Well, hey, dinner you're starting to be a candidate for the guy that eats his dinner out of the pan over the sink. With the, the more you talk, the, you ain't helping, buddy. I eat dinner in my bed. like Because I'm kid. a bachelor. Because <laughs> I'm a bachelor. Huh. I'm, I'm huh. going gonna, gonna to ask Betty. It'll be an interesting conversation. Ask the children whose hearts you have broken and their parents who no longer f- are friends with you. Okay, so one of my favorite people in the world, Gunnar Creed, uh, a kid whose life I've been in for a long time. Last mm-hmm. time I was at Derby City Classic, I brought him a you cute ball. You gifts, yes. I brought him, yeah. Yes. And and I do that. Well, yes. I'm saying when I go to kids' birthday parties, I'm usually going to get a gift. But if I don't, yeah, I'm, I might take them 20 bucks, you know. I'll give them cash. I don't always get them a card. I guess I just never cared about the card. And I'm a sappy dude. Nice shot there. I feel like I've misrepresented myself here. <laughs> You are a wonderfully nice person, and I know that you have taken back gifts from trips to children. Yeah. Of, uh, yes, I, I'm very aware of that. And I'm not saying any of that. I'm saying you're missing a step here, and I don't think you're realizing you're missing a step. And now you've confirmed you don't realize you're missing a step. So, yeah, uh, you know, we'll talk off air. I'll take the answer off air, Dr. Phil. That ball didn't turn for him at all. I am stunned that I have to bring her a gift. It, and I have to bring her a gift because I'm gone. Is that why? Have, have you, did, when you when you dated her the first few dates, did you ever take her flowers? Did you ever bring her flowers? I have. Yeah. Okay. Then what are you stunned about, buddy? Mm, I I feel like flowers is a different thing. Sometimes, like when I when I get back, if I have time before I see her, I'll try to get her flowers before I see her. I like to do stuff like that. Do you know what the longest river in the world is? It's. It's not just a river in Egypt anymore. Yeah. Ha. Huh. I had a friend ask me one time, or a guy say, uh, "Tell tell me how you feel in the comments out there." Somebody <laughs> said, uh, oh, "What's what's D? What's the what the D and Mike D stand for?" And the guy I was beaten said, "D best." Wah 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 wah. wah. Well, he was right. He had asked I'm me. I'm sure that your wife and, and daughter would about say to the just same. Happen. Yeah. He is D best. Here's hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, man. That is a bummer. All right. Oh, no. He stays at one, but loses that last ball. He's got a spot two here. Heartbreaker. Yeah, he's doing good. Case game. 
What do you think Kenny's going to make us do next? I don't know. Kenny is the taskmaster. He really is. Isn't he? He's driving us hard. Every time I turn around, Kenny's like, all right, next. Here's the new pros. Where's my jacket? (laughs) Do it. Everybody's so nice. Go get the your whole girlfriend. Bad boy stuff. family's so nice. It is misleading, isn't it? <laughs> it is. It is. They're so nice. They're so nice. They've almost made a mockery of their own bad boyism. It's Seriously. like <sighs> that was really funny having Alex be up there, and be like, "Oh, this is the bad boys." Apparently, sixty minutes was just here. Yes, yes. And yes. Rick Jones was pretty much like, "Get lost, buddy. <laughs> Piss off, sucker." That's how I tell 60 Minutes to mind their own That's business. Right. You're not Barbara Walters. So oh, man. Oh, nice we missed try, one. Jason. All right. Three, six, well, uh, three, six, nine? Okay, I was wrong. I th- okay, that was right. Because he made a ball while he fouled. So that didn't count. And he lost the ball that he sense. had. That makes sense. My fault on the scoring. Sorry, guys. So we've got, Hill, to, Hill, we've zero, got to watch zero. some great pros so far. Oh Corey Duell, Tony, Tony, Tony Johan, Johan, Skyler Woodward, Sky Woodward, Shane Van Boning, yes. Mika Eminen, Jason Shaw. It becomes a blur, doesn't it? It totally does. It's yeah. pretty wild. I've been trying to keep track of, that's the guy that beat me in Banks. He put me out. The really? guy that out nice me. Okay. Yep. Oh. He was kinder than you. Yeah. He was a good player. Wonder but also a nicer over. person than me. He has his son with him at this event. Okay. I don't think he's bringing him a stuffed animal. I feel like they're at a different place. Like, I feel like I am with my relationship. It's Ken Schumann. Look at that. That's cool, huh? Isn't that totally. Ken Schumann? I do. Ken has really... I almost don't recognize him. Did you have any idea that man had that much hair? He's kind of pulling a Mike D. Here's what I want to say about that. So much so that I hate to tell people that he has long hair because I feel like he obviously tries not to show a ponytail when he's on a camera. That could be. But I'm going to tell people anyway. Yeah. Well, he's just one of those very professional, very presentable people. He's super people. professional. Yeah, it's super I love yeah. that. He was so, I mean, he was the voice of the Derby City Classic for a long time. I agree. I agree. Man, he's just towing out on those. Nice try for Jason, but man, kind of getting in trouble here. This is a really great opportunity for Butch. It really is. He's yeah. a cross side away from being on the hill at this hill hill yeah, match. Butch has three balls to zero, huh? And he's going to be running around the table with this one. No, wide. As soon as this match is over, I'm rushing over to the table to talk to him by his name. To talk to Butch. I got to know. I got to know. He's going to say Brumback. I guarantee you that. There's no brooms there. You're right about that. The bride and Grum, you know? Uh, One real pop. Oh, oh I missed it wide. Gosh. I, you know, and I feel like... Uh, that was kind of a hasty bank there yes, for Butch. Yes, I agree. He's been he's taking a little more time on all these. And you don't want to give Jason an opening to get back in this no. thing. Yep. I notice sometimes, uh, oh, I'll take an extra stroke or, or two when it's important and when I'm nervous. Uh-huh. And I believe that that sometimes can screw you up. Even the little things like that can for sure. make the difference. You know what I, I mean? I totally uh, agree. Yeah. Safety. Playing safe. Probably a smart way to go. Gets to the rail. So it doesn't leave anything. Yeah. And so Jason's starting to tighten up. He does not want this to be the end of the tournament for him. No. We don't know if either one of these players have a loss. But I think they both do. I'm going to go out on a limb and say they do. I th- I'm li- it's life or death. I will bet that if you're watching this in 2037, you don't care. I think you're probably right. It's nice to know when it's elimination. It is nice to know. I wish I knew. Don't get me wrong. But uh, because it's not, you know, I just, uh, there's my level of feeling bad only goes so far. All right. So so nice little safety. Nice exchange here for sure. 
Uh, could definitely yeah, pocket this, this three yeah, now because yeah, the five doesn't. Try and poke him. No, okay. So he's l making sure he can't see the six or the yep, two ball. Yep. I like that shot. So he's got to come at maybe this the two ball down here on the bottom left. Yeah. I kind of like playing rail first, making the two and getting back, or the four and getting back up table. I tried that rail first oh, like you're talking out. about, and mm -hmm. it was laid wrong. I went rail into the ball, and then cue ball drifts into the pocket for the scratch. Oh, all the way across. No, here. I went rail into the ball to knock it out, and then no way. It left it just enough oh. room to drift. I, I'm on game two. It's 4-0 against that guy that I was playing good against. Jason just drew right in. And then Gosh, it was 3-0, and I thought, oh, no, he's about to come back on me now. All right. Oh, see, I told you. Let's this is going to look stupid, but I'm doing the minus one up here just to remind us. So Jason is negative one ball count. We can't do the negative up here for everybody watching out there. When well, we like to keep things positive. <laughs> hey, bada zing. All right, uh, bank in the five or the two? One um, time, probably the two, but you know. I was gonna say seven oh, two rails. Me. Excuse me, yes. Well, he's definitely not doing what I said. Playing four, four rails. rails. Wow, and that looks Drifting good. Drifting down, down, down. Nope. Oh my gosh. What a try, and he's really lucky that didn't pop out. If he hadn't hit the pocket, he would have sold that out. I agree. Yeah, for a nice straight one one rail back, straight back. And I tell, boy, this this bank says it all. Oh. If you would have made that one, that would have been big. Jeez. Okay. But so what a great balls. shot here. Yeah. They're building a the cabbage patch out in my pea farm. I got a laugh out of Paul. Yes, they are. <laughs> yes, they so are. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was a compliment. <laughs> uh, oh, boy. Bless your pea picking heart. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Making this two line, and probably ending up under the six. Oh, okay. Well, I think Jason's going to make the six. Everybody giving Ken a hard time about the hair, man. Wow. I think he looks good. I agree. Do, how do you feel about the fact that Ken Schumann has less gray hair than you? I've accepted it. Uh, I've, yeah. I've accepted that. Yeah. I did. My grandmother was white, white, white-headed. Seriously. You're just silver, though. You're a good white. shade of silver. Yeah. Well, I'm going for the Sam Elliott. Uh. My mom's license said gray at one point, and she was all disturbed about it. And one of her friends was like, well, Marie, that's just because they couldn't fit very, 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 very light blonde on there. <laughs> that's funny. And my mom insists her hair is silver to this day. Yeah. And it's true. She has that nice, like, silvery yeah. sheen. Uh, so many guys lose their hair. Uh, I'm, I'm just really glad my hairline is the same as it was when I was 16. So that's, uh, that's more of a thing for me than gray. Ooh, side pocket. Ouch. That's coming straight back, upper left-hand corner pocket. And this ball's going to line right back up under the four after he makes it. Mm. Jason hits that ball so good. Lordy. Do you think it's because he laid on the table? He looked like he was going to embrace the two. He was yeah. trying to lovingly yeah. encourage it. You could do it. He's the he could take a note from the slate whisperer here. Right, he could be the ball yeah. whisperer. I just love that there wasn't a story attached to that. I he said he's leveled over eight thousand nine foot tables. Jeez. I know. It's wild. Also surprising to have that kind of count at that point. Probably uh, events, and you know how many tables per each event, totally. and how many events per year. Yep, you yeah. probably figure out a year and or multiply it. Or he just made that up. <laughs> Which is fine. He's like, well, that's a big number. Yep. <laughs> 8,000 is a big number. Yep, there's no way for me to confirm Arbitrary. or deny. <laughs> what would impress people? 6,000? No. 800? No. no. 8,000? <laughs> 80,000? 80, too much. Is too much. I don't want to. That's ridiculous. I want to push it. <laughs> I like that shot. That's a good. 
This a lot of straight pool players play that shot. Yes. Jason Shaw, not a straight pool player. Current world record holder for running with 714 with balls. 714. You know what he didn't do the entire time he played that? Play that shot right there. <laughs> he true. didn't play safe for no, 714 balls. It's 50 some racks, right? Yes. I, I didn't understand. They were counting the racks, um, but I was wondering if they're counting 15 in a rack or 14 in a rack. Well, let's God hope they were counting 14. But there's 15 balls in a rack. Mm, well, but that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about how many balls do you make per rack? You make 14. Technically, you make 15 because there's one ball left on the table. You have to make that ball and break the rack open. So you have to make 15 balls to leave them back. Right? No, because the 15th ball is on is, your second rack. Yep. I guess it depends on when you're, when you're connecting that. I, 14 does make sense to me. I was curious, though. We should do the math. I wasn't curious until right now. Let's not do the math. And Let's trust Jason. And, and I feel like curious is not accurately depicting your emotion. You have that same look <laughs> on your face like, God, I wish Summerfield wouldn't say things. <laughs> I'm, I'm uh, wanting to read that. Oh, Lord Almighty. I need to keep notes. Get Betty a <laughs> gift. Yes, for God's sake. Gift. Uh, quit asking stupid <laughs> questions. <laughs> Oh, now this is the problem here. Uh, he definitely, uh, he left him. He likes that five. Yeah, yeah, he left him something. Oh, interesting. Man, he keeps catching that point. Oh, man, and that's dangerous. Oh, look at him. Yeah, you can Bush tell by his wrist that he's frustrated. Can't it's quite frustrated. see his face, you know, but his body posture was one of frustration. I bet the look on his face would have really got us. Did you see that man's wrist? He is furious. Oh, my gosh. All right, Butcher with a... I mean, this is one where I stay inside of it. I think you got to... The that is hit. so dangerous. Man, and this is... Jason, you don't want to piss off Jason Shaw. And Jason is... And not that he did. <laughs> and not even because he'll punch you. Because yeah, Jason's about to run... Six and yeah, and I mean it's it's yeah. Now Jason owes a ball, so there's that. But I mean, yeah, this is it's Hill Hill. Is he gonna try to clip that one? No, he's trying to be really safe here. He knows that Butch is a couple shots away from right, winning this thing. Right, right. Like we've talked with Banks, it can be that quick. I yep. mean, uh, even you know, and I was on the positive side of that sometimes, where I could make a ball for 17 shots, and then I'd get up and make three in a row, and my I know my opponent was like trying to figure out where I was the last 20 minutes, you know what I mean? You just yeah. get up and pop them in. So, yeah, that's got to be what Jason's a little worried about is that at some point Butch goes up there and just goes pop, pop. Totally. Yeah, nice match. Jason back to zero. Still needs five balls. Butch only needs two here. It's a big swing. I can, it's, you barely have to hold this one up. Oh, he held it up a little much. Do you think Butch at any point was like, you know, I'm sick of being the other Brumback. And that, like, yeah. do you think it, like, lit a fire? Or do you think he was ever like, I don't know if I want to do this anymore. Mm. It's got to be hard being the other Brumback. Yeah. Especially I, when I'm you're not related. I, I think it would probably It's like be. a little brother complex yeah, and it's yes. not even your brother. I think, yes. I think yeah. that's true. Kobe says maybe, maybe not little brother, maybe big brother. He might be older. It's hard to say. I can say. He's not. Mike D can. I can't. John's older. Yes. Uh, Butch's whole ma outfit matches. His shoes matches outfit. That's the kind of stuff I notice. He's yeah. definitely younger than John. I, I got to say. Tell me. Th this has nothing to do with where we are in the world. Okay. There, there, if you're telling me somebody named Brumback is from the same town as somebody else named Brumback, and they're not related, I don't believe you. That's Maybe there's a lot more Brumbacks down here than there are other places, but I, I think the chances are far greater that you, aren't, you didn't know you were related. Or maybe you've chosen to say, no, we're not related. Maybe you're not closely related. Um, uh, I, you know what? You have a point. You do have a legitimate point. Butch, no offense. 
two bank pool players from the same. I mean, what's next? A Jeremy Jones that lives in Texas that's married to an Amy Jones, and there's two of them? Both from Texas? Who's going to believe that? In the pool world? Couldn't happen. Hmm. Yeah. I don't think that was intentional. No. Every time that happens, Jason is getting a little more comfortable, even being down. Yeah. He's Every time something like that happens, he thinks, okay, see, that's... I'm the pro. I need to play like a pro. I yep. need to do the right thing. And that's why you see him tighten yep. up here. Yeah. I think he might take this nine ball, but I think he won't carry down to take the five next like he would <laughs> if he were playing more aggressive. I think you're right. Yeah, I think you're right. I think the five ball's makeable, but the double kiss is there, and boy, is that a scratchy shot. Yep. See, even the one, I think he's nervous about taking. Not nervous, but he's just trying to be super careful. He'd rather wait for the easy shot, wait for the perfect easy shot. Yeah. Just like one pocket. You're like, oh, why should I try this now? I should wait six minutes and right. wait for the guy to leave me a one rail. That's the one. Yeah. Boy, that counts. Good All for right. him. Jason on the board here. He wants that straight back so bad, but, man, it's just tight. He's calling it. Oh, my gosh. I don't know how this is a shot. Wow. Uh, to na na na. Wow. That's how you Jason shot. I don't even understand. <sighs> wow. <laughs> what a shot, man. Jeez. Yeah, they call that a little twister. Twisty, twisty poo. All right, two to three. Jason Mountain has come back. Butch yeah. wanting to get out of this thing. Yep, and he left him tough. Very few balls left to go here in the seventh round of the 2022 Derby City Classic. Summerfield and Mike D with Bad Boys TV. Butch Brumback versus Jason Shaw. Maybe Bonnie will tell us. Do she's at it? She yeah. tell us she's yeah. out of here. That's about it. All right, six on the side. Wow, Four this is a tough game, up. man. This has been a great set, actually. Right? Well, it's been awesome. Yeah. Yeah, and one way or the other, I mean, I think, yeah, if you're Butch, you got to walk away and say, man, I was battled. Ooh. I'm sure he's going to be a lot happier saying I beat Jason Shaw. Oh, Butch, that was a great oh shot, bro. Oh, stays out of the side Good pocket. Shot. Which is one ball one away more, here. man. A straight back away. Oh, that looks good, brother. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Butch, incredible effort there. Jason Shaw, three balls away, needs them all. And Butch Brumbeck here on the hill, so at the hill. Bank the four, make the five on purpose. Yep. Oh, oh no. Shoot. Yeah, now see that. I mean, that was the right move. Jason yeah, is now he so just bummed. So now this is, uh, this is the difference between, to me, a pro and an almost pro is the pro, I believe, makes his five ten out of ten times. You know, is, I, you know. He, I, he was down And then quick. my level, I almost make it. <laughs> Good job. Oh, no. See, that's what I'm talking oh, about, no. right? That's, yeah, that's another example. Oh, my example God, of what he I'm was out. Yeah. I can't believe it. No offense, Butch. Yeah. I mean, I... I was going to bet you money that he was going to make that ball. And at this point, I bet you money Jason wins this match. Right. That's a, that was a big swing right there. Jason that was still like, needs three. Yeah. Butch needs two. Yeah. But, I mean, Jason just figured that it's over. He just right. sold it out. Right, exactly. And at this point, Jason is not right. going to let that right. happen again. Yep, he's energized, my folks. 3-3. Three, three. You know, now who has the advantage? 3-3 three, three case game. Yep. Yeah. Brutal. He's going to play to the butt of this five ball, three down table, marries it on there. Get a rail. Make sure get the three rail, gets get there. Rail, he got there. Get a rail. Oh, my gosh. Take your time, Butch. And, again, Butch, far more professional player than, than I am or will probably ever be. I'm sure he will do just that. Whoa. Oh. Not how I want to be shooting this one. I won master singles like that. 
kind of jacked up frozen ball, banking it back in my pocket. Uh, with the opponent, my opponent did that, and he uh, miscued and gave me ball in hand on the eight ball and swept the table <laughs> when I was on the hill. Who was that? <laughs> uh, Dave from uh, from Kenmore, Kenwood, Kennewick, Golden Fleece. Got it. Yeah. Yeah, I got on the hill, Damn. and he tried to play a safety on me, and uh, I left it anyway. Nobody cares. Straight That's back how I Jason won, though, was by sitting. It was the greatest win of my life. If I mean, if Jason doesn't make this ball, Wowzers. he might be in trouble. Yeah. Another opportunity Dude. here for Butch Brumback. Butch no, two really balls like away. The five. I mean, I don't love anything either. Oh, I... I, I love mean, being at the table. Right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, the, I love know, the back banking this five. five goes, that's six. Sure. Six definitely goes. I, I don't like that three from there. They, he really wants to take the straight back just to drift down table. Taking his time here. I think he's got to take the five. All right, you and you like taking it down in the upper left-hand corner pocket. Yeah, top left. Trails it. He's back on, on the, hill. the hill. He's on the hill of the hill. I hate to root for anybody, but it's hard to not root for the guy that's not the pro. Dude, that, you know, I'm sorry. It's it. Oh man, it's wide. Ah. Who? Man. Jason needing them all, would eagle be, eye shot. Would it be inappropriate for me to go hug Butch right now? Oh, yeah. Okay. Or like to shake but up I'll, champagne and blow it? No, I want to give him a hug and tell him it's all right, man. Keep, oh, I got Stay you. in there, buddy. You can do this. I thought you meant like a fake celebratory hug. Oh, no. Like a real, it's like okay, buddy. Hug. Yeah, like a bro hug. Wow. Just tried to twist that one again. He did. Didn't quite get there. Like we did last summer. Like we did last summer. Uh, I don't like any shot from here. Uh, yeah. You like anything from here? Oh, my gosh. Wow, shooting. Yeah, I I mean, when I'm not playing this match, I like that shot. This so he's, he's, he's crossing it? Yep, it's with high right. So you're going to see it catch and duck. Yep. Oh, well, he didn't double kiss, so okay. Play, but he missed it real wide, and that leaves wide open for Jason. Man, oh, man. But I, I've never seen Jason more afraid to shoot in my life. I agree. It, it's got to be a foreign feeling for him yeah. to be like, I don't know if I should go for this ball. Very nice shot. that kind of bobbled in a little four, bit. 4-4. Four. Are you clipping this? Oh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. No, I'm, no, I'm, I'm four-railing it or three-railing it to the top left. Which I don't think goes, but I don't know what else to do. <laughs> oh my Jeez. gosh, Jason Shaw. Wow, oh what a barn burner of a match, man. So this shot, I I could see him trying the same thing. Upper right hand corner pocket. Yeah. Oh, I think he's gonna make it and drift down. Not make it. Good. Uh, I left this for my one pocket opponent only straighter and the six was close to the rail and he speared it back I couldn't believe he was able to do it I played a young guy that did that except he was jacked up at 45 degrees to avoid uh, getting uh, and he made it and I was just like oh, oh nice shot that's in no it's no. not wow <laughs> does right. it count as a prediction if you just change it that's what I'm going to do from now on that ball oh he's going to make it no he's not I think he's going to play safe or go for it. That's going to work against you. Or go for it. Oh, my gosh. Butch Brumback, Jason Shaw. What a match this has been. Seriously. Again, this is round seven. I heard in round four there were about 170 people left. So 170 people out of about five or 457. So we're in round seven now. 19. 19. I'm just kidding. Uh, less. It's, it's so less hard to tell how many people because, are Yeah, see, that's the thing. If this was a regular bracket, I could do the math because it's just by point five zero. Uh, but that's not how this, this works. We need to know how many people had buybacks and how many people didn't. And then I think three more pieces of information and graph paper. Yep. Okay, so Crayons, graph paper. I bank this to the top right as if I'm playing one pocket and my opponent just thinking, save me. 
Man, he is kicking himself. I thought Kenny was just getting a selfie with his dad. We got an argument up here at the Bad Boys booth. It's getting loud over here. We got Ken Schumann. We got Steve. I noticed McDonald. the argument starting both summer and I stand up. Yeah. <laughs> like, all right. Huh? We can have an argument if we want. <laughs> Who are you talking to? We're free to argue. <laughs> got plenty of time on my hands. That's right. Butch Brown back. Oh, my gosh. I don't know what he was thinking. You better hope that gets on the rail. Right. Oh, I don't think so. Ouch. Yeah, this, uh, I think Jason makes this uh, often. Oh, my gosh. Dude. Butch Brumback, what a match. Ladies and gentlemen, Jason, Sean, Butch Brumback. Jason taking down that round seven, 2022 Derby City oh, Classic. Oh, Butch is getting a picture with him. That's nice. Good for you guys. That's awesome. Butch, you Made, played great, brother. Oh you played God, great. You played my God, great. you almost won 19 times. Ugh. Well done. Hey, Summer, thanks for commentating. Summerfield, Mike D. Yeah. Well done. 2022 Derby City Classic. Uh, keep TV. looking for more uh, more videos, guys. Thanks for watching and all that. We appreciate it. We'll talk to you all soon. Pool is cool.